Community outreach and engagement is one of the priority areas that we want to focus in. Uh, there's nothing more important than building strong relationships with the community. And in Quebec Terrace, uh, we realize that we've had several incidents over this past year involving youth and juveniles, uh, some violent incidents as well. And this particular community uh, is home to a large uh, minority population and a large uh, population of residents that aren't uh, originally from this country. So we wanted to make sure that they understood that we take their concerns seriously, that we want to build relationships with them and we want to take proactive outreach into their neighborhood to make sure that they know uh, that the police department's there for them and we can have our officers build relationships with that community. So between September of 2019 and November of 2019, uh, the third district put together a project um, that was involving proactive community outreach and this was an all hands on deck approach where we used our community services officers our officers from our day, evening, and midnight officers uh, were briefed on a plan to really get into the neighborhood and build relationships. So uh, these officers ended up spending a total across three shifts of two and a half hours a day on foot patrol. And the goal of this detail was simply to reach out to the community, build relationships with the citizens, talk, make contact with people, listen, see what their concerns were, and then for problems that we identified, come up with strategies to address those. Uh, and the goal was really to get people comfortable with interacting with the police and we really had a lot of success there. Well, some of the, the things that came out of this that we're so very happy about are the resident feedback. Uh, we would receive comments like, I haven't heard the sound of gunshots in a month. We have seen the changes and everybody also, uh, my residents always say that they are response uh, they respond to their call and everybody I try to tell people to call them whenever they uh, need help and they say that everything got a lot better and it's getting better and I know it's gonna get even better with their help uh, when we do our pop-up tent events uh, in the neighborhood we usually have a number of children that come up and interact with us in a positive way our officers have been able to hand out uh, stickers and some other items that the kids enjoy in the neighborhood. And just those kind of intangible things really give us a sense that what we're doing over there is moving us in a positive direction with this community. So at the conclusion of the project, we had uh, over a thousand contacts with residents and we had over 128 hours of dedicated patrol uh, in this neighborhood. So we were very, very pleased with the results and some of the things that uh, we received as feedback from the residents. Uh, we want to make sure that all residents understand that they are valued no matter where they live, uh, what their background is, what their immigration status may be. Uh, our department wants to build a relationship with you.